When people first heard about the State Route 72, many thought it was just another idea that would never happen. But over time, more details have come out showing that Lockheed Martin may actually be building something remarkable, an aircraft that could go beyond the famous State Route 71 Blackbird. Rumors from Skunk Works, Lockheed's secretive design team, suggest that the next big step in U.S. aviation might already be here, quietly developed behind the scenes. Known as the State Route 72 Dark Star, this new plane is seen as the SR-71 successor and is slowly coming into view. The State Route 71 Blackbird, one of history's most iconic aircraft, was an extraordinary reconnaissance plane that shattered speed records during its operational years. Capable of reaching Mach 3.2 at altitudes of 85,000 feet, it required pilots to wear spacesuits to remain conscious. Its unmatched speed allowed it to outrun surface-to-air missiles, and its stealth features, such as radar-absorbing black iron paint and a small radar cross-section, made it an early stealth aircraft. About 85% of its frame was made of titanium, and it featured corrugated skin for strength and heat tolerance. Despite its marvels, the State Route 71 was exorbitantly expensive to operate, costing around $200,000 per hour. With a fleet of only 32 planes and unique maintenance needs, it was retired in 1990, briefly returned in the late 1990s, and finally retired by NASA in 1999. As years passed without a replacement, the pressure mounted to develop a worthy successor. The State Route 71 had famously outrun more than 4,000 missiles, operating with near impunity. Early discussions of a new hypersonic platform began in the early 2000s, with serious technological development starting around 2006 to 2007. During this time, Lockheed collaborated with Aerojet Rocketdyne to develop a new propulsion system, integrating scramjet technology, an air-breathing supersonic combustion ramjet, for the State Route 72. Unlike its predecessor, the State Route 72 is envisioned as a fully unmanned, reusable hypersonic aircraft capable of speeds exceeding Mach 5, potentially reaching 4,000 miles per hour. It is designed not only for speed but also for strategic surveillance, reconnaissance, and even offensive missions. Its high velocity and autonomous capabilities mean it can penetrate hostile airspace and deliver payloads, including hypersonic missiles, without risking human lives. As such, it's more than a spy plane. It's a high-speed, stealthy, intelligent combat drone. In 2013, Lockheed Martin officially confirmed the SR-72's development, claiming it would fly twice as fast as the State Route 71. This was not just a bold claim. Lockheed emphasized that while the State Route 71 was built using 20th century technology, the State Route 72 would be a product of cutting-edge 21st century advancements, designed with modern computing, modeling, and additive manufacturing techniques. By 2016, Lockheed's then-CEO Marilyn Hewson announced a breakthrough that would make building a hypersonic prototype the size of an F-22 Raptor possible for under $1 billion. Further confirmation came in 2018 from Lockheed executives who cited major progress enabled by advanced manufacturing and modeling. The SR-72's propulsion is built around a turbine-based combined cycle, TBCC, engine a hybrid that uses a traditional jet engine for subsonic flight and a scramjet for hypersonic travel. This transition from turbine to scramjet mid-flight is a complex challenge due to extreme temperatures and air pressure. The scramjet, with no moving parts, relies on the aircraft's velocity to compress incoming air for combustion, functioning in conditions where traditional engines would fail. The materials used for the State Route 72 must withstand intense thermal and mechanical stress prompting the use of advanced composites and heat-resistant alloys still under development. While the idea of delivering reconnaissance or strikes anywhere on Earth faster than a parcel delivery is compelling, the State Route 72 is not yet operational. Funding remains the biggest challenge. Although its development aligns with the U.S. Air Force's broader hypersonic strategy, budget constraints led the Air Force to prioritize the Northrop Grumman RQ-180, a stealth UAV seen as more cost-effective for intelligence, surveillance and reconnaissance missions. Nonetheless, the State Route 72 stands as a symbol of future warfare, a fast, stealthy, unmanned force capable of overwhelming any adversary before they even know it's there.